what is going on everyone and welcome back to another video and today i am going to be showing you guys my elo jimenez and my luis robert pc <laughs> i know you guys been wanting to see this for a while now if you haven't seen part one i do have another pc that contains um my Chicago Bulls, some other Chicago White Sox, and my basketball cards, my football cards. If you guys haven't seen that, I'm going to leave it in the eye right up here. Go check that out if you guys are interested. But this is part two of my PC collection that contains Elo Jimenez and Luis Robert. So if you're excited about this one, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Really helps out the channel a lot. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Um, Nothing to brag about. I mean, I am a Luis Robert and an Eloy. PC collector. I still have a lot to, um, of robber cards that I'm missing. I've slowed down a bit on purchasing uh, Luis robber cards since it's super, super expensive to get his cards. Even his base cards go for like 30, 40, sometimes 50 bucks. Uh, so I've calmed down just a little bit, but I'm going to get back on it uh, sometime soon. Uh, but for now, this is what I have, and uh, I'm happy to show you guys. So we're going to start off with the Eloy Jimenez collection that I have over here. So we're going to start off with the sleeve cards. Uh, first time, I'm going to show you guys this um, Allen and Ginter from this year, Eloy Jimenez. Let me put the light a little bit closer. You guys could see. Uh, there's the Eloy Jimenez. This is the black parallel of the mini from Allen and Ginter of this year. Super, super sweet. So I'll put that to the side. Then I have this Elo Jimenez from last year's Tops Fire. And then I have a whole bunch of um, his cards from this year. Uh, like this one from this year as well. Uh, this one's from Archives, I believe. Um, yeah. And then um, uh, we got that. No, this isn't from Archives, is it? Yeah, Archives. Yeah, I'm over here tweaking. Uh, but yeah, then we have the Bowman, Bowman Chrome. One thing that I don't have is his first Bowman, though. <laughs> that is a card that I do not have in my collection. So um, hopefully I could get it uh, one of these days. Uh, but yeah, this is basically just my base uh, Eloy collection from this year's Tops Chrome. Then we have a uh, 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 refractor of this year's Tops Chrome. Refractive this uh, next generation Eloy Jimenez, future stars, and then base chrome and uh, pink from this year's chrome. So that's uh, my sleeved pile. But like I said, hopefully I could uh, start getting his first Bowman. Uh, I'll work on that soon. Uh, but here we go. Let's do that little pile right here. Got from this year's Gypsy Queen. This is the green parallel of of him. Uh, decades Next 2020, Eloy Jimenez. Then I got a patch from Donruss. Nice Eloy patch. This one's from this year as well. Pretty cool uh, Eloy patch right there. And then from th I pulled this card myself. Uh, Museum Collection Eloy, 3 out of 99, if you guys could see it right there. So that one was pretty sweet. Love how that card looks. Uh, then we have the rookie cards of Eloy. Uh, we have the Tops Gallery from last year. His rookie year is last year, 2019. So uh, there I have his gallery card. Then I have his canvas um, from Heritage. So that one was pretty sweet. I put this one myself as well. So that one's awesome. Then we got a base Heritage, two of them. Rookie Performers um, from Heritage as well. But this one doesn't have the Rookie Card logo, but it says Rookie Performers right there. From Bowman Platinum, the Platinum Presence, Elo Jimenez. And then we have his base, one, two of them. And then Bowman's Best, Elo Jimenez Rookie Card there as well. And then we have this pile. We have Elo Jimenez Rookie Debut. We got two of those. That is from the update series. There you go. Then we have a holiday Eloy Jimenez bringing in the holidays right there. Then we have a refractor of uh, 2019 Tops Chrome. This one I picked up on the eBay lot. Super happy. And this is when we start getting to the base Chrome Eloy's. So we got one, 
two, three base chromes. Then we have an X fractor of Eloy Jimenez right there. Love it. Nice rookie card. Then we have the paper. One, two, three, four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven paper. Eloy Jimenez uh, from series two. Nice. 11 i always forget how many i have of these you know sometimes i grab them and i just you know i put them in the in the box and i always you know lose track of um how many rookie cards i have that's crazy 11 paper but there you go that is my elo Jimenez rookie list uh and here are the autographs so i have one from this year's museum collection numbered 96 out of 99 right there then I have Gypsy Queen from last year. This is his rookie card, Gypsy Queen on card auto, Eloy Jimenez. Uh, I don't believe this one is numbered. No, this one's not numbered, but there's that. Then I have from Topps Tribute from last year. Um, this one is numbered 67 out of 99 on card auto right there. There's the back. I mean, this is triple threads. I'm sorry, I said tribute. I, I guess I'll, tops triple threads. <laughs> but there's the back. So that one's a nice one added to my collection. Then I have 2019 Tops Inception on card auto, 33 out of 50, the orange on card as well. It's a nice one. Rookies and Emerging Stars autograph of Eloy Jimenez. So that was pretty cool. And then I have last year's museum collection as well on card auto, 22 out of 58, which is a weird number. Is that 58? No, that's 50. 22 out of 50. Um, Ido Jimenez right there from Topps Museum Collection last year. So there's that. And then my last auto is my shortest print auto that I picked up earlier this year. It is a diamond icons from this year on card red ink three out of five. This is my most, I believe my most valuable Eloy. Um, I picked this up. We made a deal with, I made a deal with the eBay seller. Really, really cool guy. And uh, man, I love this, uh, this Eloy card right here. 2020 tops diamond icons. Diamond Icons is just expensive to rip myself. So I just decided to pick up the uh, Elo Jimenez, the card that I wanted. So there you go. Three out of five. Beautiful, beautiful card. So I'll put that back there. But now let's get into the Luis Robert collection. What everyone's been wanting to see. Uh, but here we go. We'll start off with the sleeved pile. So I have a whole bunch of uh, his prospects from this year's Bowman Chrome. Got a couple there. And then we have uh, this. I believe this is last year's Bowman Chrome. Yeah, last year, 2019 Bowman Chrome, Luis Robert. So it wasn't his first Bowman. His first Bowman was 2018. And then I have a couple of his uh, paper uh, prospect cards right there. And then I have his rookie card from this year's uh, 2020 Bowman, Luis Robert rookie cards, one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And I believe I still have some more uh, top loaded because that's how they came in, but 14 here. And then this year's Diamond Kings, Luis Robert. I love this card. I, as you, if you guys know me, I love cards that look like art, like painted uh, art pictures and stuff. This card looks awesome to me. Super, super cool. Uh, Louis Robert right there, rookie card. But that is what I have in the sleeves. And now let's get into the top loaded um, top loaded cards right here. So we'll start off with this year's uh, Gypsy Queen. We got the mini of Louis Robert right there, sent to me by a fellow subscriber. Thank you so much. And then, yeah, so I bought these and they already came in top loader. So I didn't want to take them out and put them in the sleeve. So you're going to see a whole bunch of those that are there, but they're actually top loaded. But, uh, yep, this year's Bowman Chrome cards right there. And then we have a mojo of uh, Louis Robert Bowman Chrome, the prospect card. 
And then we have the first edition Luis Robert um, paper Bowman from the first edition box that came out earlier this year. So we got one, two, three of those first editions. Then we have the Copa cards of Luis Robert, one right there, and the patch card numbered 389 out of 914 right there. Um, Luis Robert, uh, this is the living set, I believe, that came out on the Tops website. Um, I picked this up, and I believe this is the living set. That's how it looks like. The, the living set, Luis Robert, rookie card right there. And then this is the game within the game, Luis Robert. Uh, I got this off the website as well, and Tops actually made an error because they forgot to put the rookie card logo on it. And uh, I, I didn't know at the moment. I was like, oh, okay, you know, it probably doesn't come with it. Uh, I, I wasn't too sure. But then uh, a few weeks after they sent me this one, without notice or anything, they sent me this one. So I was like, oh, okay, I, I guess. So this one has the rookie card logo. This one's the error card. So I have both of them. Then I have uh, Luis Robert uh, commemorative coin. This one's from this year's top series two. To stop. Yeah, top series two, I believe. Uh, you got these in the um, yeah twenty twenty top series two. Um, we got these in the blaster boxes. So, uh, but actually, I bought this one on eBay. Um, really wanted this coin. I love when cards are like really really thick, and I loved seeing this card. And I was like, I need it. So I ended up getting it. So there's that. Then I have Luis Robert rookie card from this year's Gypsy Queen. I have a couple of those. One, two. Three, four, five, six, six Luis Robert um, Gypsy Queen cards, uh, just the plain back ones. Um, but yeah, super happy to have those in my collection. I love Gypsy Queen; looks really, really clean, really nice. So there's that. Then we have here um, Luis Robert rated rookie from this year's Donruss. Well, everything's this year because this year's his uh, rookie year. Uh, two, three of those, and then I have the optic as well. One, two of those, and then uh, I have this yellow parallel, the Dollar Tree exclusive Donruss uh, rated rookie. Um, this was in a trade with my um, friend of mine, uh, Pack Rat Thirteen on YouTube. So I was super, super happy to have this in my collection. Um, I love this card so much. Then we have the mythical um, refractor or prism card, as they say in uh, um, Panini. But there's that. Got the prism. And then I have the base there as well. Then we have the rookies from Optic. Look at this face right there. <laughs> I love this card. Uh, yeah, so I have the rookies from Optic. And then I have the rainbow, uh, which most of you know that I'm trying to put together. The Mojo Rainbow of Spanning the Globe of Luis Robert. So I have the purple out of 250. I have the pink out of 199. I have the blue out of 150. I have the green out of 99. I have the gold out of 50. And then the orange one is not the Mojo because I haven't seen it yet. But I have this one out of 25. And then I have the base. Um, but yeah, trying to complete the rainbow. Um, Hopefully, I'll, I'll, I'll start doing some more research. Hopefully, I could find uh, the, the rest of them. I know there's the red out of five. That's going to be super difficult to find. And then I do got to find the orange mojo one. This one's just a plain one, uh, plain orange. But here we go. And then we have the refractor spanning the globe. We have four of those to add to the collection. And then we have this one, the mojo. Um, uh, Luis Robert. This is the photo uh, variation. This one was also uh, included in that trade with the pack rat. Uh, thank you so much, man. Really, really enjoy having this in my collection. Super, super cool. Um, so that that's the uh, photo variation. Variation, and then we have the tops finest uh, Luis Robert right there. But here we go. Last of this stack, uh, we have the Luis Robert demand card. I pulled this in my uh in my video as well from 2020 tops finest right there and then we have yeah you see we have um, a couple of these uh bowman rookie cards again then we have the 2030 luis robert rookie card right there that was sent to me 
by Camille. Thank you so much. Really, really appreciate you sending me um, uh, Robert cards for the PC. We have the Bowman. Uh, this one's the 1990 uh, throwback right there. And we have the Cracked Ice, and this one is numbered 111 out of a 150. Then we have Louis Strauber from Select. This is a jumbo patch. I picked this up on eBay for super cheap right before he started to go off. And uh, super excited to have that one in my collection. Then we have another Louis Robert from this year's Diamond Kings. Uh, Louis Robert Select Hot Rookies card right there. And then we have the Top 100. He is number two. Uh, Bauman Scouts uh, of Louis Robert right there. Yep, right there. And then um, we'll start off with this pile right here. Uh, I believe it's this pile. Let me see if I could grab the right amount. Yeah, right here. So then we have the next generation Luis Robert rookie card. I picked this up not too while ago. Super happy that I picked this up because you can no longer get these on the Topps website, only on the secondary market. And then these are basically going to be uh, Topps Now cards. Um, rookie tallies four hits, uh, home run in first game of the leadout spot. So I have just one of those. And then I have the Towering Blast Marks first MLB home run. Got uh, five of those. So they come in a lot of one, five, I think 20, one, five or 20. So I always picked up five, except for this one. I don't know why I snoozed on that one. Uh, collects first career hit on first pitch scene. So I got five of those. Then I have named AL Rookie of the Month, five of those. And then this one is the blue. This one's the numbered one, 45 out of 49, which I was happy to get. Um, let me have first career MLB walk-off home run in the 5-2 win, uh, five of those. And then this Luis Robert 3D card, man, this thing's sweet. Look at that, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> well, there you go. That's that. Then we have um, this year's National uh, Card Day, Baseball Card Day, Luis Robert. I picked up from eBay. Unfortunately, I didn't have the time to go to uh, my LCS to get the packs, uh, but I did want this Luis Robert card, so I picked that up. Then we have three, I believe, of the first uh, Bowman paper of Luis Robert. One, two, three. And then we get to his uh, rookie card. His um, first, I guess you could say, uh, rookie card from the set um, from Top Series 2. Uh, the only reason why we get Top Series 2 is for the Luis Robert rookie card. I do have a jumbo box still waiting there for me to rip. Uh, so hopefully we could rip that soon. But we have one, two, three of those, of the paper ones. And then we have this one, the short print from opening day. This was sent to me by fellow subscriber and Patreon member Camille. Um, as you guys know, I do have a series of me opening opening day to try to find this card. It, I've been doing it since I started the channel. And um, yeah, it's, it's tough. And she decided to send it to me. She had an extra one and she decided to send it to me. So I'm extremely grateful to have this card in my collection because it's so hard to pull. <laughs> so thank you, Camille, once again. I have only one of those. <laughs> and then we have the Topps Chrome uh, Louis Schrauber. One, two, three, four, five, six of those. Six Chrome. Then we have the 85 Louis Schrauber. One, two of those. We have the 2020 Bowman Sterling. I have two of those. Luis Robert right there. Then we have this one. I love this card from 2020 um, uh, Archives. There's that. And then this one from Archives Snapshot, Luis Robert. Awesome. And then I just pulled this not too long ago. The 2020 Tops Finest. Luis Robert base. So awesome. And then my Luis Robert from 2020 Tops of Fire autograph card numbered to 50. 15 of 50 right there. 
and from museum collection 48 out of 50 on card Luis Robert so awesome and then um, my most my top um, my one touched Luis Robert cards are right over here here we have the Luis Robert from museum collection this is the case hit pick this up on eBay so you send it down on the screw screw down so super happy to have this in my collection as well it's a case hit so it's extremely hard to hit so there's that and then here i have my luis robert from this year's diamond kings this was a case hit as well i remember ripping up the box at the moment i did not know what it was i just thought it was a really cool insert really cool card but this was a case hit and um, I pulled this myself, so I was extremely happy to have this in my collection. Just an awesome card. The Black Panther, that's his nickname, eating the deep dish Chicago pizza. You got the background there with the Chicago bean, the skyline. It's just such an awesome card. Uh, so I love this card. One of my favorite cards in my collection. And then I have the Bowman Sapphire Luis Robert rookie card. Um, so that one's a sweet card as well. Hopefully I could get my hands on the Topps Chrome uh, Robert card, but that one's gonna be super expensive. <laughs> so, but maybe maybe one day it'll, it'll, it'll find its way to my collection. Then I have here the Diamond Icons, three out of 10 Luis Robert on card auto right there. That's such a sweet card. I love the black, the silver. It just goes really well with the colors of the White Sox. So I have that as well. And then my favorite card, I would have to say, is this 2018 Bowman uh, Chrome First Bowman Gem Mint 10. Um, in my first video of the channel, I unboxed this. Uh, this is what started off the channel, this card right here. Uh, so I was super happy to have this. It was one of the first cards I bought on eBay. Uh, and it's a gem mint 10. So this is always going to uh, hold a, a place in my heart. I'm always going to keep this card forever. I'm not going to let go of this card. Um, but yeah, this was one of the cards, uh, that I bought on eBay when I first started my page, when I first started to collect cards, um, this was the first one I wanted and I got it. And this was really, really cheap when I got it. And then he started to go off, uh, the card world started to go off and then the prices just went up after that so super excited to have this super happy to have this in my collection uh but there you go guys that is everything oh yeah and i forgot to show you this big old jumbo <laughs> uh louis robert love this card hopefully i could get this in the smaller version i got 22 out of 49 right there the jumbo card of louis robert from series two this is the short print um but yeah, that big old jumbo thing right there. <laughs> but there you go, guys. I really do hope you guys enjoyed seeing my collection. I hope to expand it um, uh, later on in the future. Hopefully, I could just keep it growing and growing and show you guys the updates. Uh, but that's what I have to this day. Um, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you are new to this channel, please consider subscribing. I rip open baseball, basketball, and football on here. Ring that notification bell so you guys get notified when I post a new video. I hope everyone has a blessed rest of your day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.